I'm Coach JG, head of North American Preparatory Hockey Academy. I will lead with this and say, this is not a topic that I felt like talking about today, but because it's just so frequent now, I gotta say something. I had an email in the summer last year um, that came from a parent where her kid was skating with a spring team and um, a local spring team. And this guy, this coach came up to this player and grabbed him and said, hey, you don't play for any prep and like took the sticker off this kid's helmet. Like that's where we are with this now. Like that's what's going on. How, how much more petty can we be? I don't know what to say. All, I think the bottom line for me is that it doesn't matter where a kid plays as long as he's playing. There's one rink that's open year round in this entire state. And we're going around and putting them in a really hard spot to be put in the middle to choose. That's not a good place for a little kid to be. This kid was nine years old and you skated over to him. You took him by the helmet and ripped a sticker off. This is not like the only story I've heard of this. I mean, I've heard people tell them to take their sweatshirts off, their jerseys off, hats off, anything that has anything to do with any prep. Like enough is enough. We are just a small hockey academy that takes a very big interest in player development. And if players come to choose to train here, they should be allowed to come and train here. It's ridiculous. And you know exactly who you are. Let these kids play. Never once have I ever threatened to take his sticker or don't wear that, that, that hoodie around that's representing another Team Montana or a Team Northwest or a Vipers. Who cares as long as they're playing? I can't figure it out. You know, I can't figure it out. I've been told that, you know, our cost structure is messed up or, you know, it's because we're a for-profit program, you know, that I'm conning people. And this is a good one. I'm uh, selling snake oil. I don't even know what that is. Um, but I hear all this and I'm just like, are you kidding me? Like, where else can you go in the state for $99 and get four and a half hours of ice time and fun instruction and your kid has a good time? You know, and most of this stuff is done by, most of this stuff is being done by people that have never even been associated with our program, never even tried it, never even stepped on the ice. They just sit along the boards blackballing and blacklisting and saying as many negative things they can about myself, about our program. Like, when's it gonna end? Because I can tell you one thing, we're not going anywhere. We now have 800 participants that have played with us since the concept in 2017. 800, that's more kids than some have in their entire program. So what is the beef? What's the mix up? This program may not be for everybody and that is okay. But for the ones that come, they come for a reason. They come for a reason. They should not be ashamed and they should not be upset about wanting to do that. So stop putting our kids in that position. Just stop. Let's, let's, be, uh, what do we, let's be adults. How about that? I don't understand what's going on. I mean, I think I just have to leave it at this. Is, is there a deeper issue at hand? And I'll just leave it at that. All right. This is Coach JJ. Thank you for coming to Coach's Chat. You guys have a great day.